Welcome, Shinobi. Today's mission is simple yet demanding, just like Rock Lee's training. We'll tackle Leak Code 1534. Count good triplets. No shortcuts, just pure effort. Just like Lee, you're given an array of integers and three thresholds, A, B, and C. Your task is to count the number of triplets I, J, K that satisfy all of these conditions. One, I is less than J, and J is less than K. Two, the absolute value of RR at I minus R at J is less than or equal to A. Three, the absolute value of AR at J minus R at K is less than or equal to B. Four, the absolute value of R at I minus R at K is less than or equal to C. Basically find all valid triplets where the differences between elements follow these rules. To solve this, Rock Lee uses Taijutsu, brute force, triple loop, full commitment. He checks every possible triplet I, J, K, one by one, no ninja tricks here. Let's walk through this with an example and actually count those good triplets. Let's run the code with this example. Array is three, zero, one, one, nine, seven, A is seven, B is two, and C is three. Here's what happens, step by step. Start with I equals zero. So R at I is three. Now try J equals one, R at J is zero. Check the first condition. Absolute value of three minus zero is three, which is less than or equal to seven. Good. Now try all K greater than J. Try K equals two. R at K is one. Absolute value of zero minus one is one, less than or equal to B, which is two. Absolute value of three minus one is two, less than or equal to C, which is three. This is a valid triplet, three, zero, one. Now K equals three, R at K is again one. Absolute value of zero minus one is still one, okay? Absolute value of three minus one is still two, okay? Another valid triplet, three, zero, one. Now try K equals four, R at K is nine. Absolute value of zero minus nine is nine, which is greater than B. Trip fails condition B, skip. K equals five, R at K is seven. Absolute value of zero minus seven is seven, which is also greater than B. Skip. Now move to J equals two. R at J is one. Absolute value of three minus one is two, okay? Try K equals three. R at K is one. Absolute value of one minus one is zero, okay? Absolute value of three minus one is two, also okay. Valid triplet, three, one, one. Try J equals three. R at J is one again. We've already tried this pair, so we skip duplicate triplets. J equals four or five. Absolute difference between 3 and 9 is 6, and 3 and 7 is 4. Both still satisfy emission, but then further conditions fail later, so let's move on. Now we try I equals 1. R at I is 0. J equals 2. R at J is 1. Absolute value of 0 minus 1 is 1. Okay? K equals 3. R at K is 1. Absolute value of 1 minus 1 is 0. Okay? Absolute value of 0 minus 1 is 1. Okay? Valid triplet 0, 1, 1. All other combinations either repeat or fail. Let's count our valid triplets again. Triplet 1, 3, 0, 1. Triplet 2, 3, 0, 1 from the second matching count test of your bassins. Triplet 3, 3, 1, 1. Triplet 4, 0, 1, 1. Final answer. Four mission accomplished. Our training is complete for now. Time to evaluate the cost of this battle. Let's move to the complexity analysis. Time complexity is O of n cubed because of three nested loops. Space complexity is O of 1 since we don't use any extra space. And just like that, we've successfully completed our mission one step at a time, just like Rock Lee. Hard work, precision, and dedication always pay off. Stay focused, stay consistent, and we'll see you in the next training session. Until then, keep your ninja spirit alive.